Hey guys, Happy New Year's, and yes, I, I know that I'm kind of late on that one. It was a, yesterday was technically New Year's, but today is the first time, today's the first year of me doing Let's Plays in videos, so it's a little bit confusing if you ask me. That being said though, I hope you guys are all having a fantastic beginning to your New Year's, I sincerely am. But with that said... We gotta start this year off proper, at least I have to start this year off proper, I should say. And how should I do that? Why, with a Let's Play, of course. But a Let's Play of what, you might ask? Well, of course, it must be something horrifying to begin the New Year's. Why do I insist on torturing myself? Another one? Where are you all coming from? I thought I fixed... Uh, never mind. Hello there. It seems you're a traveler. Like myself. Right. Given your psychic makeup, you must be new to all this. You're a traveler. Okay. Someone with the ability to travel. Why is everything all shaky? You probably. Am I having a seizure? On a gate, and that brought you here. What Why did you bring me here? You what did I do? Your being here has caused me to be stuck, so I'll need you to reach me. Currently, this dimension is tearing itself apart. Too much magic gone wrong. Right. To top that all off, we're both here. Which causes more instability. Not to mention this entire dimension is rather small. I'm trapped by some magic wards. Really? No doubt they're going to be in your way too. When I was looking around here before you came, I noticed the wards are linked to the candles. Blowing out the candles should remove the wards. They'll probably light themselves back up after a while, so you'll have to be quick about it. Right, because candlelight like controls you everything. Go home and I'll fix this place. Because you're a newly discovered traveler, I'll walk you through what I can from here. Ah, by the way, there's a ghost girl who lives here, so don't wreck the place, okay? A ghost? No doubt she wasn't planning on visitors. Alright, well, I leave you to it. Go look around. Me and so ghosts haven't really gotten along this far, I think. Which is where I am, by the way. Well, at least things aren't so shaky. That's something to be proud of, I guess. Uh... Blow out. Blow out. Okay. Uh, do I go out this door now? Oh. Well, this is some pitch dark blackness right here. Not sure if that's a good thing. Right. Flashlight time. Alright, let's see. This way. Uh, okay, what's with all the broken mirrors? If I know my... Horror, right? Broken mirrors. Um, I highly doubt there will be anything. Yeah, broken mirrors is usually never a good idea. Such a place. Right. Hold up a second. I'm not sure if you noticed, but you can turn on the lights if you really? so desire. Really? It's just a matter of hitting the light switch. Simple, yeah, really. Yeah. Really. Anyway, carry on. Something burning. What's burning? Why is it burning? There's a hole in the ceiling. Who knows what could be up there? Hmm. Perhaps we can find a way up. No, the real question is, do I want to find a way up there? The answer is... Not really. Oh! What the fudge? Um, okay. Big glowing symbol means I cannot go into there. That's... Okay. So now I must go down into the basement. Because, of course, nothing ever, ever bad happens in the basement. And down further we go. Hold up. I sense a soul stone around A what? They're magical stones that allow for teleportation. Handy things that Granted, they get their name because they link your soul to them. Assuming there isn't a soul on the mate. So I guess there's that downside. You probably need it to reach me. I'd why do I must I use things called soul stones, which paper. link to my own soul? No, no, soul stone. I mean, that that's highly suspect. I'm pretty sure you shouldn't go around linking your soul to things. That's usually a, a way to start trouble. Usually a good way to get yourself into trouble. And... There it is. I suppose you ought to pick it up. Okay. I may already be bound, so be careful. Okay, I just picked it up. Nothing bad happened so far. <laughs> I say that, but I'm expecting something bad to happen pretty darn quick. What the... What did I just... Whoa! What the fudge? Oh, okay, so I can literally go somewhere. That's 
good, I suppose. Uh, might be good for quick escapes, I suppose. And yet, it doesn't solve how to get through the red glowy portal symbol things. So, I'm not exactly sure what use this soul stone is gonna be. Again, I'm not too sure linking your soul to a stone is such a good idea. There we are. Now we're in the attic. Why are we in the attic? What is here in the attic? Is it something good? Is it something spooky? Hmm. I sense a couple of candles around here. Look carefully. They could be. So is my goal in this whole thing just to blow out candles of a ghost girl? Don't your ability to find it, though. Carry on. That's my whole goal here, isn't it? Just to find candles to blow out, isn't it? Uh huh. I see. There we go. Torn pictures was popular. Looking at that wall over there. It's torn paper and art. Well, regardless. Well, I guess in some certain circumstances it can be labeled as art. I mean, I don't see why it couldn't be. Alright, now if things follow suit. This should now allow me to get through those places that have the uh, red symbols that glow. So, possibly a way to progress? What a mess. Yeah. My, did I ever clean here? I don't know. You said it was haunted, so I'm guessing that the owners left in a hurry. Maybe they, they weren't big on the cleaning. Maybe that's why they were being haunted, because they weren't all that clean. Well, I wouldn't really know. My taste in aesthetics, as you can see, is kind of plain, so... Not sure I'm the best authority of what's aesthetically pleasing. Okay, so I've blown out red, blue, and what looked like an orange candle. Does that mean yes, it does? I can continue onward into this haunted house. Strange. Another soul stone is nearby. Be careful. Soul stones are extremely rare. Two in one place is almost unheard of. Though that would be useful for getting around. Having two I see the ghost. A little dangerous. I see there's a ghost. After all, if one breaks, well, let's just say having half a soul is a good thing. I'm sorry, what now? Great, so what I'm technically using is a... I'm just gonna take that. No, you don't need to, you know, no need to go after me or nothing. Just... Do I need to talk to you? Should I talk? Another visitor. Okay. It's been so many years since I've last had any visitors. And now right, the guy in the basement to me. I've almost forgotten what it's like to have anyone else around. It's been too long since Well, I've you really should think about cleaning out the place. You might draw more people uh, in if it's all nice and tidy and, you know, not terrifying. What the? Let me blow you out. Let me blow you. All right. Only the white candle appears to be left. I don't know. Why are you still on? What other candle is there? Okay, quick recap. I am in a haunted house, haunted mansion, that has soul stones that basically split your soul in half, and if they break, well, let's just say you really, really don't want them to break. Oh, I see what, I think I see what this is now. They said that they, they come on a cage, they come back on in, in time, so I guess I have to get out there pretty darn fast. Hi, Ghosty Girl, you got any useful information for me? Because I'm kind of lost here. I really should have decorated the place. Right? Yes, you should have. Though, then again, I suppose I just go through that is a That is a, that is a that is a actual yeah, plus side to being a ghost, where you don't have to worry about like, that kind of stuff. Okay. All right, did that do anything? Did that do anything? Did that do anything? Please tell me it did something. It did bubkiss! Absolute bubkiss! Okay, so these guys are still off. So that must mean I need to get those, blow those, uh, those other, those, those orange candles out. I mean, that's the, what the fudge? Why did, I just bugged out the game. I just bugged out the game, whoa! Please do not try to do that again. I don't know what I did. Okay, you're still on like I thought you were. All right, so let us blow you out. Go down here, blow you out. Did that work? I blew you out a 
basically the same moment. Like, n there was no real... Okay, there we go. That was... Okay, that was the trick. I needed to be in two places at once, basically. All right. Now I don't need to worry about that no more. Now, let's see. Can I go down for... What is with you? Okay, so basically what I found is that... Like the other ones, I need to pretty much blow these cannons out at the exact same moment. Otherwise, they just reignite themselves by the time I get to the other one. That's why I've been running around the whole time. Makes sense to me, I suppose. This is a haunted ghostly house. It would make sense that there's some haunted ghostly BS happening around here. Ugh, it's clunky works. You know, you really should have thought a bit more about the architecture of this place. I mean, seriously, I keep bumping into everything. Alright, that should have taken care of it. Did it take care of it? If it didn't, I'm gonna be supremely pissed. And I am pissed! What do you want from me? Somebody let me out of this house or tell me what I gotta do. What am I missing? I've blown out both candles. At basically the same interval. Like I did the other orange ones. What am I missing? Okay, let's try this. Okay, let's try this one. Let's try, let's try super fast. Okay, there we go. There we go. And you. There we go. And... You and back down here. Are you still out? Why can I not move? There we go. Thank you for letting me out. Why are you still? Doesn't matter. Does not matter. Oh, screw you, you white glowing symbol of, of, of disappointment. Okay, I'm finding this is quickly becoming going from being a scary game to kind of a, a frustrating game. Kind of wish I knew what was going on. Can I go over that side? Oh, I can go over that side. Okay, so now we know what's going on. Okay, now we know what's going on. Now we know why I couldn't blow out those other ones. There's one hiding here the whole time! Mmm. Now, <coughs> one big bl one big blow to blow them away. <gasps> you go down there? I gotta get over here. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Let me hurry, let me hurry, let me freaking hurry! There we go, 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 and blow you out. Go down here. God, we're gonna make it this one time, folks. I feel we're gonna make it. I think we're gonna make it. Please let us make it. Did that work? Please tell me that worked. I want it to work so badly. I don't get you! I've been doing what you asked of me! I've been blowing out the candles. I've been opening the doors. I've been talking to the ghosts in a haunted house. What do you want from me? I don't know. I don't know. The only way I could get to all three candles, by the way, is by having three soul stones, which I do not have. I need one soul stone to get to the other place and then to throw out so I can get out of there. But then I need a third soul, soul stone to be placed at the very bottom of the basement so I can blow that one out. Because if I leave one of them on for too long, the others just reignite anyway. What do you want from me? Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, please give a like, maybe a share, comments, always appreciate because it lets me know how I'm doing to you guys. No, wait. And of course, subscribes help oodles and oodles. This is Lucris, and I'll catch you guys in the next game. Happy New Year's.